how to make this big melodic techno lead stabs. So we have a simple pigment sound here. We're gonna turn this off for now and then go for the engine two and then we're gonna pick the analog. Now I want a chord on top of that, a power chord. So I'm gonna turn this one octave down and put this minus five, so perfect fifth. And then volume up a little bit. And then this one, volume up again. So this will be like a top layer, bottom layer and the perfect fifth. And then unison. Bring down the stereo. And then I'm gonna go for the filter and pick something like some filter. And the first thing, go to envelope 2 and create kind of half plucky long release envelope. And put that, I'm going to do this, put it here, put a bit less. And then do the same thing here, put maybe somewhere here. So that I can hear this tail. And then the main trick of this type of sound is actually using another complex waveform. In this case, I will use the wavetable and modulate this sound with that sound. Here, I'm going to turn this on. Volume, if it turns off, if we bring this volume, this doesn't go anywhere. So it's just a modulator. And then here, I'm going to go for like a bit more complex waveform. Let's pick something like this. And then engine two. And here in mode later, we're going to go for engine one. So engine one is modulating engine two. And here we will pick the amount. Do you see it? And the cool thing is actually you can kind of decide how much you're going to modulate with this one with volume over here. Like here. And then I'm going to go for like plus 19. So again, perfect. You can actually decide if you want to go for full stereo. Let's stereo. Let's go full stereo. Make it big. A bit more tail. And to make this sound a bit more aggressive, what you need to do go for effects. First, pick distortion, and I'm gonna go for distortion. This will make the sound darker, but more saturated. And then I'm gonna go for. EQ, pick a parameter, parameter EQ. That distortion saturates the sound and brings more and more higher tones and it's a bit more pleasant to hear. Right? Maybe playing with a bit like so that they're a bit phased out. And then what we need is actually maybe a bit more distortion and big reverb so that we can really feel the ambience. Distortion. Reverb. Transient shaper for just focusing on the attack. And then a delay. Now here, depending on how it goes, you can use X-ray EQ if you want a bit mids or a bit lows. Again, it should, this should depend a little bit your other elements in your track. Maybe something like this. Let's play it together with the track. If you want more sounds like this, check out my Pigments Top 60 Melodic Techno preset pack.